I wish I hadn't had this experience, but I have. Just because you have cancer, you are not a dead person walking. We're surviving with cancer. It's manageable. You know, there are reasons to be optimistic. Things are happening fast. This could be the life changer for all of them. Because of cancer research, I'm able to live a completely normal life. As exciting as these last few years have been, we've just scratched the surface. No longer are we measuring these responses and survival in months. We're measuring them in years. The progress in science has underpinned all of these therapeutic advances. And so now the AACR can embrace the therapies and the clinical results because they all came from the science that the AACR has been supporting for the last century. We want everybody to be able to be around to tell their story of how they beat cancer. I walked into not knowing much about what a trial was like. I had to learn working with my doctor. But what I have learned is that it is the one opportunity where you can give hope back to a patient. Without clinical research, I'm dead. Without clinical research, my friends are dead. Without clinical research, we can't, we can't stop and eradicate a disease. We don't have clinical research. Cancer will beat us, and cancer will beat us all. And very often you see things like it extends a patient's life three months, five months, 12 months. But those months matter. That's time where you have maybe five more months with your children. You have it with family and friends. That is time where there's no price you can put on that to give someone hope. I feel as a metastatic breast cancer patient that I'm almost begging for my next drug. And I don't think that I should have to be in the position of begging for another drug. I'm at the end of approved treatment. The only options I have are drugs that are in research. The government, the private research pharmaceutical and other medical research companies and not-for-profits, they all have to work closely together to make this happen. Government has to really, really step up and, and, and fund cancer research in a much bigger way. We need more research, we need more funds, we need, we need a better way because these kids, these kids are our future. There are many, many people who are wonderful, wonderful people, authors, teachers, amazing people that will be able to continue to be part of our society and contributing parts of our society because of clinical research. If I was to speak to Congress, I would say, I implore you to find another way to cut. This is not the place. It's, it's not the place.